It's now December, it's the holiday season, it's my favorite time of year, but I know it can also be a very stressful time of year when it comes to gift shopping. So huge thank you to Macy's for sponsoring this video. I'm gonna be talking to you guys about the Macy's Gift Finder, which has been so super helpful. Online, Macy's has what's called the Macy's Gift Finder, and basically it has curated the best gifts and lets you shop by price, category, or interest. So whether you're looking for inspiration or value, uh, they have a wide variety of brands, designers at great price points and a bunch of different categories so like beauty, fashion, home. Uh, so they have it all because obviously no two people are alike. So finding something that fits people's unique style can be a bit challenging, but this, they kind of all put it in one source for you. So it's really great to be able to shop through different categories. I'm gonna share some items that I currently have gotten already from Macy's and then I'm gonna show you guys some other little ideas that I have and some things that are currently on the way. So hopefully it gives you some gift ideas for him, for her, for whoever you're shopping for. So first I wanna show you guys a really good deal that I got on some coupe glasses. These are so sought after. I just feel like they're such a great versatile glass. They're super pretty. I think these would be a really great gift for a friend or for your mom or somebody like that. They just look really, really pretty and really nice. Another gift idea that could be truly for anybody is a throw blanket. This one uh, I love. I got it in this terracotta color um, because I think my mom would really enjoy this color. Uh, but there's so many different ones and I just think that they make such a good gift and it's something that sometimes you don't think to buy yourself. For my husband, if you know him, you know he loves to make a good cocktail. So I thought what would be a great gift is a little bar set. I think this is a really great gift idea. It's a really generous gift. It's really nice and I think he will get a lot of use out of it. Another for him gift is a little skincare set. This I know specifically Patrick loves, um, but I actually think my dad would really enjoy this he just doesn't know it yet um, so this is a great gift to introdu introduce something new because Macy's has a bunch of different like gift sets um, in the beauty category which I think is a really great idea for the holidays and then this other one is a really great one for a lot of different women in your life and that is a bathrobe they have a bunch of men's bathrobes too but i think this one is so just luxe and nice um just like a classic white bathrobe is such a nice gift i know i would personally love to get that a few other things i have my eye on are some men's slippers i saw these ones from ugg that i thought patrick would really really like and then of course i went all in in the beauty section and skincare makeup products are so amazing to receive as gift. So those are just a few of the items I'm gifting this year. Hopefully you got a few extra ideas, but definitely head over to macy's.com slash gift finder for even more ideas. The gift under section is a really great tool because I know everybody's on a budget this holiday season. So definitely check that out. I will have a link in the description box below. It's lunchtime, so you guys know I like to share with you guys some like quick and easy recipes. So I'm gonna make a chicken salad sandwich. Kind of feels like it's something that you would eat in the summer, but I eat it all year round because I just think it's a really good sandwich. It's easy for lunch, uh, and it's a great way to use leftover chicken, which we always have a ton of because Theo loves chicken. So I'm gonna show you guys how I make it and tell you everything I put in it. So first up over here, I'm toasting some almonds. I think toasted almonds taste way better than just raw almonds and things. Um, and then I put celery, green onion, and I eyeball everything. I know that's kind of annoying, but I'll show you guys the portions. I'm just making a portion for one sandwich. You can obviously batch make this, but um, I'll show you guys the amounts of everything. I put in red grapes. I know this is like a hit or miss for some people. Some people like grapes in their chicken salad. Um, I've also put in cranberries. I really like that. Uh, lemon juice, parsley, and tarragon. And then my concoction of just eyeball. <laughs> I know that's annoying, but I literally just do mayo, Dijon mustard, salt and pepper. Use way more mayo than Dijon mustard, um, but just a little bit and then once I mix it all together I'll decide if it needs more or not but that's kind of to start and then for bread I have sourdough right now so I'm gonna use sourdough bread I love sourdough um, but I also think a chicken salad tastes really good on like a rye bread so it just depends on what you like or what you have That's 
essentially it. I'm gonna assemble it into a sandwich now, but the best part about this recipe is you can modify the ingredients to however you like. If you like more of one thing, less of one thing, you know, that's the best part. So I am gonna put this on the sandwich and then I personally like it pressed. I love sandwiches that are like toasted. So I'm gonna do that uh, and then I'm gonna eat it. This is what she looks like, gorge. I love a good sandwich. This is nothing new. Everyone knows a good chicken salad, but I thought I'd share. So if you try it, I hope you like it. But I'm gonna finish eating this before Theo wakes up from his nap. And I will see you after. <laughs> Season, we're making gingerbread houses or I should say decorating them so I've set up the camera we're gonna do a little decor battle on who has the best gingerbread house and you're probably wondering who's the judge none other than Theo we would have him help us decorate which we still might but we just didn't want to do the whole thing because he's still a little too young he'll put all these really small candy pieces in his mouth and we don't want that so we're gonna decorate it and have fun and then he's gonna join in and then he will be the judge. You can also let us know in the comments which one's your favorite. I need to like have inspiration or something. Let's see, what's you coming You can't take to it me? from me. I'm gonna flip this around. This is, this is what Tess is doing. Look at what Patrick's already done. Look okay, at that. Relax. Come on. Where do you think it's she not... got this idea? What do you mean, the licorice? Yeah. I haven't been looking. I haven't been looking. I've been minding my business. Let's, let's. <laughs> Look at that, the little wreath. I love that. I got it off the box, so don't. <laughs> <laughs> these, now these lights on top, I think I've seen them somewhere. Okay, no, you cannot compare this masterpiece to that. I can't talk about it. And you know, want to know the worst part? You don't part? like my icicles? You want to know the worst part? Theo's gonna pick yours. But you know what? I'm taking my time, okay? Things can't be rushed. This is art. You're done. I can't help but noticing you're just snacking over there. <laughs> <laughs> our judge has woken up. We're gonna give you guys our final reveal of our gingerbread houses, and then he's gonna pick mm -hmm. his favorite. <laughs> In one corner, we have Patrick's. Obviously superior. <laughs> and then this one is mine. They're both incredibly chaotic. <gasps> okay, we're just assessing. So he said obviously that was a poor aesthetic choice. <laughs> so I'm gonna remove that, because that was dumb. Ooh, he really does not like those runners on top. Okay. Theo, are you inspecting my house or do you like it the most? Okay, this judge is tough. Okay. Mine's holding up. Inspect that one. Oh, he seems to gun. have removed your fence. Not the gumdrop buttons. <laughs> He's really taking his time deciding which house he likes. Mama's or Dada's house? Mamas? I'm taking that as a win. Wow, wow, wow. I'm gonna end the vlog here. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys are all enjoying your holiday season so far. Huge thank you again to Macy's for sponsoring this video. And yeah, I will see you all in my next video. Bye.